With my recent return to Ark Omega, I thought what better of a time to combine all of the videos I've played over there and turn it into one massive movie for you guys to enjoy. This mod has crazy dinos, loads of modded items and weapons, engram pages that are literally like quadruple the size of Ark's normal one, and so much more to offer. So if you guys do enjoy, stick around and enjoy this uh, very, very long thing. But just real quickly though, if you guys play on PlayStation and you've been feeling left out lately, well, look no further than Tropical Arc 20X, which is wiping this Saturday. It's a six man server with plenty of maps to choose from, custom cave changes, a bunch of 20 slots, 50 slots, 32 slot servers, and they have made loads of changes for this season, such as Ab Flyers being allowed, Gen 1 Flyers being allowed, and Desmo's being banned for the first 24 hours. If you're interested, check out the Discord link below, and thank you Tropical for sponsoring the video. Now, since we kind of learned the basics of Arc Omega, I now knew what to do. My plan straight away was to get myself down an Omega workbench and get myself one of those ethereal spears crafted. As one, they are infinite, and two, if you get the right gear in combination with it, it can basically one-shot quite a lot of the dinos in this mod. Just look at me here, I'm just chucking them at these carbos and other things and I'm doing like 5-6k damage already. It's uh, pretty mad. We also finally started to get some loot drops out of dinos, which are stuff like quest scrolls, which, well, quest scrolls, and if you complete them, you get items at the end, but I don't do too many of them out of the video because I don't really see a point in them, to be honest. I'm sure they're OP in their own way, but... Killing stuff and just looting them is my favorite thing to do. I'm not going to lie. Seeing the, the bright lights. I just learned tech engrams from that thing. I didn't even know that was possible, to be honest. I'm still learning stuff about this mod, but all I know is get a good set of gear that buffs the spear and you're, you're basically good to go. I don't have any, uh, I don't have anything to stack sets though. I've got very different stats at the moment, but if I get four items of this, this Tempest stuff, oh my god, look at it. The buffs you get, the boomerang, OP. I've got everything on me. If this thing doesn't give me something good, I'll be shocked. Because look at what's happening to me. Oh my god, what? What's there? No, the tech bubbles blocked the loot, no. Oh. 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 I need to pick it all up for it. Wait, where'd it go? Oh my god, I need to just grab it all before I die. Ow. Oh my god. Wait, what am I wearing? Something makes me... This t-shirt, it makes me float. I've got low gravity when jumping around now. Well, that means that uh, fall damage basically isn't a worry for me anymore, which is... Uh, that's nice. I, I can't move. Oh, oh, I've been turned to stone. Ooh, something yellow. Oh. It gives me a mount? Oh my god, wait, that's so cool. I need to try that thing some point soon. When I actually need to use it and I'm about to die. Oh, I'm floating. When I'm about to die. What is a what is that? A protective magic charm? What does it do? How do you equip it? Oh, offhand. Uh, damage taken reduced by 24. Health increased by... Okay, chance to die. Oh, nice. Oh my god, I move so fast. Oh, another core. Oh, that one's a necromancer core. I got a cloner staff unlocked as well. What? So apparently killing the better tier dinos unlocks engrams because I've unlocked tech stuff now. Also unlocked a bunch of uh, stuff for the Omega mod. This is, this is sweet. We're getting places now. Not too long after, I got myself an even better Ascendant Metal Charm. And I was also collecting a bunch of souls and Savaru and a bunch of carrots as well, just to make sure I would have enough to make Kibble later on to tame stuff. Uh, now those are pretty useful. I didn't, no, useless. I don't actually need those at the moment. Where were these ones? The Hazard Pants. What did I just get? Uh, actually they're not... Apart from the armor, they ain't, they ain't actually much better. Where's the other one? What bus did this give again? It just made boomerang and gave me immune to freezing. 
Yeah. Never mind. Oh, I just found my first guy logged out. <laughs> he didn't... Well, I say he didn't make it past. He, he leveled himself up. But, uh, yeah, he didn't bother with anything else. Probably found the mod too hard. It is a bit of a, uh, a headache when you try to uh, play it for the first time. It is very confusing. I, I literally... I can't see. I, I, I literally, I, I can't see. I'm gonna, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, but I'm dead. <sighs> oh, I'm gonna use this getaway thing. Oh, wait, why, why did I get given a basilisk? What? I didn't want this. I wanted a different one. <laughs> I guess, like, they are situous. Can I- can you not hit? Oh, they've made it so you can't even hit with this thing. Huh. Um. Can you re you can't use it at all? What if I just level it into, like, full move? I guess- No, because if I use full movement, it's just gonna disappear. <laughs> Maybe you could use these to, like, soak bases. Oh. Oh, and it's gone. Well, that was, um... That was pretty pointless, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, I think we've actually gathered quite... A, we've gathered enough now. Like, so much more than last video. We've also got a bunch of scrolls to do. Kill 4,000 wild dinos whilst riding an, like, an overwrap. So, like, who's, I'm not doing that. What's this one? Kill 2,000 wild dinos? That's not too bad. Two... Uh, you can see the rewards on them. I didn't even know. You basically just get souls. But, yeah, we collected a bunch of stuff from Primal Fear. We've got a bunch of stuff from Omega. We have a bunch of souls. Hide. I don't know usual i'm just gonna float somewhere and then we'll build all right since this is a different server we could have people living in <laughs> yeah i'm not going there <laughs> we could have people living here though that's the hope i want to kind of i want to find someone to raid. Ooh, base i want to find someone to raid at least once at least one base we had such a downer in the last one. <gasps> oh, oh hello hello Oh, wait, there's actually stuff in there. Oh, oh, I need, I need, um, what do I need? Do I have electronics? Yes. Wait, no, I don't have, do I have silicas? No. Okay. I need to, we're coming back to raid this guy. It's the, ooh, his name, Tribo Denub. Me too, buddy. Me too. Blah, blah, blah. Ooh. Dude, I just found that on the floor. That was that was that was very lucky. But it kind of makes like a flashbang noise. That that that, that actually not too bad to spot. Ooh, what's that? Item collector. Uh, when was he last on? I don't know what the times are. What's this? That's a pretty good pteranodon. Can I break this all? Am I gonna get jumped by his pteranodon? That was one hit. Oh my god. <laughs> Ooh. We need some of that. What about this? Anything special? Ooh, yay! I'm, I'm gonna break this as well. Oh, nothing. I'm not gonna kill this round on. I feel like that's taking it too far. Can I not break this? No, item collector? I doubt it. Mm, oh, do I kill this thing? No, 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 no. That's mean. Oh, wait, the, the ability thing. It doesn't run out. Wait, if I jump? Use, use, use. Oh, I get a griffin! Oh my god! Wait. You still can't hit with them. Wait, if I dive bomb? No, okay. So wait. Oh, why? Did I, no, wait. No, no, go away. Why? Why is this happening? No, I didn't want this. So when does it? When does it expire? Get away. Forty seconds. Oh, okay. <laughs> this is this is nice transport. I need to look for a uh, tech dino for the rest of my electronics, and then we're good to raid it. Oh my god. It it, it, it didn't last forty seconds. <laughs> <laughs> it still has to get the getaway thing. Wait, can I use it again? Is it infinite? I don't I don't understand. No, it doesn't feel infinite. Oh my god. Oh. Was that a tech rap? Tech raptor! No! No! Oh, I'm not even gonna get it, am I? I'll I'll to be honest, I'll I'll take that. That's <laughs> that's just about enough.
I'm literally going to Fortnite myself to stay alive for a bit whilst I craft everything up. I can't, re I can't risk dying, man. This has taken a while to get. Hello? Can you? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm going to have to pick this up and redo it. There we go. I'm, 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 oh, I'm no longer stuck. Something was holding me in midair. Was it you? It was this thing, the singularity thing. Oh, wait. Oh, no, I jumped by accident. <laughs> My bad. Oh my god. What? Oh my. It's actually so lucky I used my getaway pet thing. Oh wait. Oh no, I'm definitely making it out. I didn't even know those little bubble things they shoot stun you. But we managed to make it out with charcoal and everything now, so we're good. Ah, oh, nice. We're back at base. Let me just uh, warm myself back in again. Nice. Wait, where's my. I <laughs> can't. I'm going to demolish this. There we go, nice. All my sparks done, sweet. We can just whack this in, and then we should go, be able to go raid that base in a minute. After a bit of time of farming, we were doing pretty good. We had ourselves a one by one setup, soon extending it into a two by one. Now, we didn't exactly need loads of space because all we needed to do at this point was craft C4, raid the base inside of the Helm's Deep location, and then move on to something bigger and better. Nice C4, and the perfect amount made. Nice. Oh, we can go raid our first base now. I've got way too much on me, man. We need to go make an actual base soon. Let's, uh, let's go raid this one and see what we can get. I don't think it's 6x out here, is it? Oh my god, it is. Oh, <laughs> this guy... Wait. Oh, please say their stuff's open. Wait. Oh, they have a good boomerang. <gasps> okay, it goes deeper. Nice. I uh, thought these guys were noobs, but apparently not. Oh, they actually have some good stuff. Need to take that or anything here? No? Okay, we're good. Wait. Why am I flying? Oh. I thought... Hmm. Does it look like there's anything in there? Maybe not. They probably just walled it. Ah, uh, they're all locked, man. Oh, I'm going to have to break through them. Oh, my God. I'm breaking through them regardless. What have you got? Oh, nice mamma saddle. A bunch of these souls. Dude, we're going to be able to make so much kibble once we start getting eggs and stuff. Um, essences as well. My inventory is going to be capped. I need to... Uh, I definitely need to get a base sometime soon. Oh, listen to this one. More saddles? Are these... Oh, okay, wait. I'm, just... oh, I'm actually going to have to take this all. I'm not going to have enough space. Why do they have artifacts as well? So random. Oh my god, wait, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I didn't, didn't mean to take the foundation out. I've got that high of melee. Oh, no, stop. I don't want to kill you, bro. Oh, fine. But you dodged? Oh my god. <laughs> Poor thing. I'm sorry, bro. I didn't want to do that. Yo, guys, I think I'm going to have to just take your food as well. Sorry. Um, I've, le I've left you with... Oh, do I break... Wait, can I just... <laughs> <laughs> that is not fair. Honestly, that is... Oh, God. That is not fair. Wait, I need some of this poly. Why are there mantises out here? I can definitely... <laughs> Give me some poly. <gasps> oh, no. No, no, no. No, no. I want this. <gasps> that spear looks so much better than the one I have now. What does it do? Oh. Okay, wait. How much? 162? 151. Actually, that's not as much as I thought it was. Well, at least it does the uh, the same damage boosting as well. Oh, wait. Now I have that, I can actually use the boomerang. <laughs> wait, that's such a good boomerang. With that, wait, so this does... Oh, okay, I don't actually have a full Tempest set, so it's not going to be as good. Once it does get better, though, I can just be like, what the? Um... <laughs> we need to go test this thing. What the? Is that my boomerang? Wait, my boomerang did that. 
<laughs> I need to PvP with this thing, dude. What? All right, now to look like I was never here. Give me a griffin. Whee! Did, did I at least get the kit? Oh, I put it all in the vault, I'm guessing. Am I gonna... Can I open it without crash? I crashed again. <sighs> okay, okay. It just... It crashes my game every time I open it. Something's inside that kit that is quite literally just crashing my entire PC. Uh, and I don't know what it is. Yeah, so if you couldn't tell what was going on there, basically, I reached the point where I could finally grab one of the kits on the server. So, I decided to grab the one that gives me turrets to make sure my base would be safe as I logged off overnight, and then it would keep crashing my game. But, I ended up using the transfer mode and like just putting it all in my inventory and it ended up solving the issue. But, as you'll see later on, there's still crash issues. Well, not my weapon, my gloves, but if you read it, it says unarmed t punches teleport you forward. Look, watch this. I don't want... I just accidentally went into the mesh a second ago. Look. Let's see if I can do it here. No, it, it literally... I, I, ju I just went... No, it's not It's not working now. I, I promise you, I just teleported in the mesh and died. Well, I don't know. I got scammed. But this tech suit doesn't even work, so I'm probably not going to wear it. But, um, yeah, that stuff disappeared, most of it. We managed to get the turrets, the, the tech bench and the stuff. I don't think we have a, actually any of the engrams to use it. So, I don't know what I'm going to use them on for the time being. But having a transmitter and stuff, yeah. No, this is this is so good. Kind of, well, I say kind of helpful. This is very helpful. So, after getting my base set up, I decided to go explore the server more. And then I would come across my first player. And this is what happened next. Yeah, that was pretty tragic. To be honest, though, it was just my fault. I should have, you know, realized people can leave their stuff on neutral. Just because I'm playing on modded doesn't mean they won't. And to top it all off, they do like 10 million damage a hit. So I probably should have bowled his thing beforehand and moved on. But once I got back to base, my base had also been swarmed and infested by these uh, bats. So, um, yeah. Safe to say, I definitely put a lot of my turrets on <laughs> Wild Tames after this. <laughs> after that absolute embarrassment, I decided to log off for the night. And once I got back on in the morning, I was feeling refreshed with so much on my mind that I could do. Anyway, base is safe though, so we ain't got much to worry about. I am still very annoyed though that I ended up dying last night and losing everything. Did my, yeah, that made as well, sweet. We can also start making some more AR, but I'm out of the gas. Yeah, me dying, like, to be honest, I should have expected it. I should have bowled his di Dynonicus thing, but uh, <laughs> yeah, that was a, uh, that was a big yikes. 
Alright, since we have so many of these, I'm gonna open some of these early game tokens. I'm gonna craft like five of them. I've got so much, so many basic soul essences and stuff. I'm just, I'm generally just wanna see what I can get. They're probably gonna get nothing, as it literally says early game set. But, uh, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Let's have a look, shall we? One. Ooh. I mean, that's good if I'm taming. What about this? Uh, no. No. Ah, uh, you know what? I'm actually going to craft a bunch more. Like, uh, uh, how many souls do I have? Let's craft 20. I want to see if I can get myself a full, like, ethereal spear set to do more damage. That, that, that's, that's a dream. Come on, man. Can I get something good? Phantom damage. Immune to torpor. That's kind of good, actually, to be honest. Uh, no. More boomerang. Malice, no. 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 Uh, dude, I don't... I'm just gonna spam. Maybe I'll get something good out of this. It doesn't care. I don't care about Jura. I just, I just want spears. Okay, now we can go for it all. Uh, no. 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 Oh, It doesn't stay nighttime on this server, though, so that set of gear is useless. No, no. No. Ooh, uh... You gain the defender buff. That sounds OP. Uh, no, no. Ooh. Getaway minions can attack. Wait, that's kind of OP on the Piper. Do I have a? If I have a full set of that, that's good to wear. Malice, no. Uh, no, this seems good to be honest. I didn't get anything. Uh, oh, I got one set. I got one piece of the Soul Scream. Really? <laughs> oh my God, bro. Oh. I can have full- I have a full set of Piper gear now. I collected the other pieces from my other side, so... I don't have my getaway thing anymore because I lost it. But once we get one, we can use it and we can actually attack with the dinos, which is really OP. And it's nice to know. I hear turrets going off. I'm being- My god! Oh my god! Ah! My god, what's going on, bro? <laughs> I hear turrets going off over here. I think, I think it's in this cave. Yeah. Oh my god. Well, I've I've found a. Um, I don't think those people know that those turrets can be rocketed. <laughs> yeah. What are you saying, fam? No, die. Yeah. This this gear ain't ain't too hot. I'm not gonna lie. Without without the uh, without the ethereal buff, I'm now noticing the big difference. You do so like you do a lot less damage. Okay, I don't exactly have a remote to come back here, but I know where it is. So I need to, I need to go get charcoal, come back, then we can just rocket everything, I guess, and blow in. Right, let me check it out online. Now these guys, uh, no, they haven't been online for a bit. Okay, we should be good. God, this is a lot of photon turrets. Oh my god, what? Is the rocket even gonna reach that far? Ow! Bro! You ru- Oh my god! god I'm out of stamp! No! Alright, let's see... If this works. Oh my god. I'm lagging. I destroy. Yeah, I destroyed absolutely loads. I shoot another one. The rockets are working. I need to make sure there's absolutely none of these left because if there is, they're just not breaking. No, I'm not getting in because I'll die. Demolish more. Nice. There's more. I just need to keep shooting around. I'm kind of guessing. I need to make sure, as I said, every single last one needs to go though. These aren't like normal arc turrets. These are the the, the most broken thing you can get to defend your base. Okay, well, I'm out of rockets already. Is that a player? I think that was a player that walked in there by accident. Oh, no. I mean, someone knows that this base is here. Okay, well, I need to I need to port back to my home. Ow. Okay. And he killed me instantly. 4k damage on the pot. That hit them. 
Nice, we got some more down. How close can I get? Have I demolished? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. I need to hit these couple here. I think that's about right. Please? That's a bit too low. A bit higher. I think these are the last couple, actually. I think I've done well and hit most of them. Is that not... Oh, am I too far? Okay. Right there. Please, because these are my last couple of rockets. I'm going to have to go farm Polly if I don't hit it soon. <laughs> no. I'm going to go a bit closer. Right here. Is it hit? Okay, I think we got rid of them all. There might be like one or two left. Yeah, there's a couple around the corner. Alright, let me try and get those from this angle. Because they, they will still kill you. Like, even one or two is enough to, to ruin you. Ooh! I think they're all down. What did this guy have? Was this me? Oh no, this was just like a new player. Alright, I think they're all down. No, they're not. Oh my god! <laughs> that, that hurt. Oh, that's my last rocket. Nice. Are you down? Are you down? Oh my god, man. How many batteries? Not a lot. Alright, I need in. As soon as I saw them, I just, I didn't... Oh, the door's open. Alright, oh, well, there's the first photon turret. How many are there? There's the Jenny. Okay. Oh. I need to... <laughs> need to blow up, I guess, into the Jenny. Oh, no. No, down. Down. Oh, my God. You jumped way too high on this. I shouldn't even... I can just tech punch, can't I? Yeah. Where is the... Uh... The Jenny? Is it here? I'm just trying to guess here, on a whim. Is that it? Was it the gen? No, I don't think it was. Oh, it's like there. I wasn't even, I wasn't even near it. Oh no, that was someone teleporting. Did they teleport here? No, that's the wrong thing. Put on the helmet. Okay, no, we're good. We're good. Alright, I'm gonna, I think it's here. I just need to get the... Oh my god, no, it's there. Is that gonna work? Hmm. Yes, okay, I dropped it. That was like a little sniping shot. They all down? Hello? You're not gonna shoot? Yes, no shoot. Nice. Very good. What you got? Anything special? I need to loot this quick. There's loads of people teleporting everywhere. I'm a bit worried. Don't you dare crash. Oh my god. What? I just... Alright. Now I know not to open that. Because that thing is broken. Uh, but we're back in at least. So can I... I don't think the spear is going to break anything though. 400% crossbow of him. I just need to start quickly looting and taking what I can. Anything here? Oh, nice fabby. Well in here. Uh, nice tranks. Arrows. I don't really care about the uh, Primal Fear stuff. I will take that set of flag though. It's nice to have a good set. Oh, I can't break the tech tier workbench. That's kind of annoying. Can I break all of this? <laughs> I can just walk through with a pickaxe, man. Oh, wait. I need to... I need to turn that on. I need to make sure I'm okay. Oh! Hello? Loot! Oh, there's nothing here? Oh, okay. A anything? No? Huh. Ah, there's a lot of vaults, though. I sense there's going to be a problem. Kill machine, anything? No, we got some more stuff, though. The storage box. Uh, we'll take the souls. I think that's the only thing we'll really need here. Uh, hide, maybe? Sure. I'm scared. Forge. Nice amount of metal and charcoal. Nice amount of metal and charcoal as well. Nice. What with this? <gasps> Nothing.
I don't know who's got who's got a teleporter, but that's kind of scary. Someone's played enough to have a teleporter on this server. It means that I am still on the cards to be raided 100%. Is there any like celestial saddles or anything like demonic? No. Okay. Oh my god! My mouse just stopped working. Hello? Mouse? Hello? Oh, I think I think my mouse is broke. Oh no, it's back. Alright, well, it's just these. What? What? Did they don't What? Did none of them have loot in them? There's no way they would have dropped from one rocket. It's just What? What? Nah, no way. Where where are they gone? I don't I don't believe this. Where are they? Huh? Well, that just doesn't work. You can't open it without crashing, so I've just gotta leave that stuff and not not bother. It doesn't literally does not work. Ah, maybe stuff dropped through the floor. Alright, well, I guess I'll pick up some of the photon battery ammo. There's so much though, it's gonna take forever. I might just uh ignore it to be honest. Yeah, I ain't doing that. I'm going back to base, bro. This is a very nice raid, though. We've done... I think we've done two? Two actual raids on the server, and, um... One... One, like, Bob raid, I think it was. Doesn't count. So, it's been a while since we've been on Arc Omega. Arc still in a stale state, views are down, everything's down, but to be honest, I'm still finding fun in modded Arc, so we're going to come back and do some Arc Omega stuff for today, and if I'm honest, it's been so long since I've played this mod, I've completely forgot what to do, and what sort of stuff to look for, like, I don't even remember if I can kill this thing or not, I don't know what's OP, what's not, but anyways, we're going to give this as much as a go as we can, and uh, yeah, welcome to Arc Omega, I guess everyone again. So, to start myself off with this mod pack, I just came accustomed to starting with these things. So, in Arc Omega, it gives you a newbie protection at the start of the server, which boosts like XP and a few other things. And on top of that, you also start with a pickaxe that can turn into a hatchet and some weird little sickle thing. So, for the beginning of my life, I went around and farmed up any resource nodes I could. That being metal ore, trees, stone for flint and... Uh, yeah, I also went around picking a bunch of bushes up as well with this sickle to get a bunch of berries, magical essence, and then I would head over to Blue Obelisk where I would hit these little boxes like I do in most of my series that start on rank. If you didn't know, it can give you loads of arrows, crossbows, pikes, swords, and just tools in general. And once I'd done that, I went to the obelisk and came across my first player left tame, which I wanted to kill for its saddle, but then I realized this server gives you a starter kit. So I put it all on, got my own Tyranodon together, and then I turned off PvE and went straight into PvP as uh, we wanted to raid people, of course. Why else would we be here? Well. I thought someone was raiding them, but apparently not. That's definitely not raidable for me at the moment. Everything that goes near those turrets is absolutely being shredded. I think that's their tech gen there though, isn't it? And they only have one and it's in the middle. Unsure how raiding goes on Arc Omega, but if we get to a point where we can raid that, we definitely will. Found a base. In PvE. It is. He hasn't built anything I can open. No, but the Yals have a pretty decent base down. Okay, well, we at least know of a raid for the future. I'll come back and check it in a few hours and see if PB's turned off. Um, excuse me? Ex excuse me? I'm, I'm being bombed. But, uh, uh, I thought it was just a rainbow. What is going on? 
Ow, ow. I want to check if there's gear. Please, leave me alone. Ow. Ooh. After literally fighting a black hole, I went around and farmed a bunch of beaver dams as I wanted to grab myself some paste, electronics, and see if they'd put anything else custom inside it. And then I would go over to charcoal trees and use the pickaxe version and the hatchet because I'd forget to change it sometimes to grab as much charcoal as I possibly could to make sure I could craft up as much bullets as I would need later on when I would build my base. And then I settled on my base spot, but first I had a few more things to do. Ooh. Oh, primitive medallions. I forget what these do in this mod. Medallions are good though, if I remember. I'm just, I don't know what it does. A obsidian set? Okay. I think we should be able to raid. Why is it? Okay, I was just constantly. Re okay, apparently I can't equip. Can I. My game that bugged. Hello? No? Okay. Well, so. This server actually has something that I didn't think would be enabled. But if I go over to potions, let's look at the immortality potion. If you guys remember the last time we played this server, or I can't remember any Ark Omega server, you can use this potion to basically just run into any base and drop the whole thing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up some, uh, well, foundations, get myself some C4 made, get myself some rockets made, and we're going to go raid this base. And we're going to get rich super quickly on this server, and it shouldn't take long. But first, I've got to do the early parts of just grinding this all together. So, uh, yeah, let me, uh, get a look. let's get a little montage going, shall we? But sadly, I would make a big discovery, as since the last time I've played on this server, they have actually disabled these potions and set the max player, like, level on them needed as level 1000. So, even though I had all the resources and everything starting out ready for a kit, I couldn't exactly raid the base that way. But I remembered all of the turrets that were there were tech turrets, so all I would need to do now is craft a rocket launcher and just use that and try and take down as much as I can. I don't think he has any heavies. I don't think he does. I think I can raid this if he doesn't have ORP. Which would be good. The immortality potion is level 1000, so it's been taken off the server. But it doesn't mean we can't do it another way. But None of them are taking damage. Are they RP? The base really... RP? What? I'm so confused. It's not telling me it is. Ah, no damage numbers. I see now. And I'm guessing the base is no longer 6x, apparently. Okay, this is going to take a lot longer than I thought. Maybe I did drop that foundation, I didn't realize. Oh, I'm stupid. There's nothing in this base. They put, there's nothing in it. 1k shards in each. I've generally sat here rocketing this this whole time. There's nothing here. There's, I need to get a bit closer to that. I might just run in run in and just absolutely just I don't know have a look because this is weird man yeah there's literally nothing in the base okay I guess we can move on then I've got nothing no point in wasting any more time here let's go go do some stuff that a very disappointing raid and news out of the way, I went and hit this drop to get myself a really good Tyrannodon saddle, and whilst trying to switch it over, my Tyrannodon got wiped out by this little, uh, little snake. So anyway, I would head to Triple Waterfall, as that is where I wanted to build my base. Okay, I'm opting for building in Triple Waterfall. I really 
I don't know. I don't feel like we're going to get raided. The server's quite dead at the moment. But there is some raids to do. And I'm going to need quite a bit of space. So, I figured, why not? Let's just, let's just do it. And I guess I'm going to have to roll on the, uh, the building montage as usual. These things take forever. With all my foundations now placed out, I'd also craft out my crafting area, which was literally just a couple tech reps for now, and the, all the modded workbenches below it. I'd also go around and scatter turrets everywhere, but to be honest, because it's 3am, I'm not going to do a very fast edit for it. Uh, just to let you know, I probably put down, what, two, three hundred turrets, and most of the tech turrets were capped, and the AP turrets, which are very much needed on this server, weren't capped, they didn't have much to ammo. Anyway, I got onto crafting as much ammo as I could in all of the weapons workbenches to make sure I wouldn't run out. And then it was time to go look for a raid. But first, okay, we'll have this as the base for now. It's already like nearly 3 a.m. in the morning, so not too fussed to be honest. And with how many turrets other bases have, this is like definitely enough. My only downside is not being able to do an auto crafter on the server, like a proper one that crafts uh, modded bullets. Because they actually, uh, they craft artifacts and i'm unsure if the i'm unsure if they're in drops on this server i have to go see but yeah we're just doing ammo farming at the moment and then i'm gonna go farm up some ethereal souls and uh yeah we're gonna get a move on see if we can get some good stuff going This looks good. The PvE. Not even PvE protection. Oh my god, this actually could be... This could be a good raid. Nice. Okay, I'm going to place down a teleporter and we're going to come back. I hope to god this guy isn't online as things are about to get messy as long as I can blow in obviously I don't see anyone I don't see anyone here hey loot oh some stuff what What? Where did those... Where did those bags just go? Oh my god, that's a lot of kibble though. God damn. Thank you. Why is it... I'm confused. I'm very confused. Some of the bags are just disappearing straight up. Take all his resources here oh my god um ascendant ethereal spear hello god damn anything in here all right we're gonna have to drop these i don't want to we got to i need to get out of here before he returns if if he's on hello anything where is that ethereal spear here it is i'm terrified Nothing in the rep either. Okay. Oh, I'm I'm blo I'm black boxed. Oh my god. Did not expect to get that. Oh, and I have loads of cloth gear as well. Uh, anything primitive? Oh, one of these charms. Got that. Oh my god, there's still so much stuff in here. Exomech, I definitely don't need that. I'll take the GP though. Does he have any artifacts? No, but he has loads of souls. Uh, we can take all of these for sure. I need to get out of here before he returns. Anything else? Oh my god, he has loads. Essence? Yep. Oh my god, he has loads of tames in here. Here's the torches as well. Clubs, really good start. Bro, 
I couldn't have got a better raid. I literally couldn't have got a better raid. With loads of loot now secured, I would head back to base as there was a couple other players on the server and I didn't know if this guy was one of them. So I went back and depoted all of the important loot I could, grabbed some more rockets and then I would return with hopes of him not being there. I'm right, making a return in. Yeah? No, he's not here. I don't think he's online. So I think we're good. He would have known by now if we were raiding him. Ascendant. Let's see if there's anything Ascendant left in here. Alright, nice. Any journeyman? Ooh. Decent gear. Anything Mastercraft? Yep. Uh, apprentice. Yes, also. And Ramshackle. Nice. Now, in Arc Omega, you can build different sets of gear, which gives you different stats, which is why I'm taking so long to pick through this vault and find out as much of the good loot as I can, as I would want to wear a full set of Olympian our gear to stack it on top of the Ascendant raided. Torch. We can return back to our base now, start adding more ammo, and actually get a good look through all the loot. I think I actually got some really good loot in the gear department. We got Pteranodons. Orin, just pygmy armor. Okay, put down a pygmy dino. I didn't even know those were a thing in this. What are these? Set medallions provide set items when his players gain equip the game to get soul scream gloves. Okay, so those just like are for different pieces of gear that you have, and it gives you an extra level. We got kibble for basically everything. Omega cosmic kibble. We got summoner kibble. Crazy. Rampage, Stone Skin, maybe that will help in running one of the bases. Reaper Pheromone, more Kibble. Yeah, we're actually, uh, we're actually stacked after one raid. That's crazy. Okay, and we got a Reflective Trike. I wonder if we can soak bases with that thing. That curious to, that's curious to me. We also got a bunch more gear. Oh, Gravity Gloves. Have I got a full set of Gravity Gear now? Possibly. We got ethereal spears though, which is nice. Watch the uh, scale with melee damage. Okay. To be honest, I don't really know what to do with all this loot. I've kind of just been uh, it's all been dumped on me now. A lot of this stuff is really good. Like we got some good Olympian gear that I could partner up with some stuff. But there's also a really good ascendant set of flag here as well, which I could also wear. Choices. What is that? Wait. Gifted set. 200 fortune. Okay, interesting. Bloodlust as well. Beta hide. Nice. Now, I also managed to get myself the Psycho Scorpion, which I didn't exactly know it did, to be honest. I'm still not aware of what half the stuff does on Ark Omega, as I've only really played on PvP. But anyways, we would level this thing into mostly health, and I would put loads of points into melee damage, as with how much it was gaining, I was sure that it could literally one-tap anything on the server with this much. Probably not the higher tier stuff, but, uh, you know, it was handy having one and not having to tame it, so... Uh, Thank you to the person I raid, if you if you watch this. Oh, we actually got a really good Pteranodon. Beta Reflective Pteranodon. Look at his, like, melee damage, health. And we got 190 levels put into this thing. I'm going to speed run it. Loads into HP and then loads into melee. And we're going to go around and see what we can absolutely destroy with this thing. Wait, my character's doing voodoo stuff because I've maxed out one of my uh, my builds. I wonder if it's uh, okay. Now, uh, now we've got nearly 200 in each AP turret. That's fine for now. They're there mainly to kill the players, and tech turrets is there to kill the tames. I need photon turrets as well, but I'll do I'll do those a bit later. Mainly focus on this for now. We've got a full set of gear going. I need to grab that pteranodon because I forgot it. I want to see how much damage this torch does and what it can actually break. But um, things are going good, man. That raid, just, I don't know, chef's kiss, yummy. With this OP new Pteranodon, I would go out and put it to the test. And it passed, doing 150k damage on a C-spin and to top it all off, one-shotting nearly anything I came across. This thing really was a mini destroyer. I don't even remember crafting all those tactical rifles. The game just crashed and I come back to check the ammo situation and it's just... It's just full of assault rifles. I don't even understand. I do want to check one thing though. How much damage does this do? 
If I'm glowing, but can I not damage my own tame? Apparently not with this stuff. I need to go test this on because I'm wearing four pieces of the Hades gear, which granted isn't a full set, but I probably could wear the full Olympian set with that. Yeah, now I'm in a full set. So I think I'm in the full set. Oh no, I'm not because the charm, this gives me the gloves. Wait, what? what's not Olympian? Hello? Eh? Ah, maybe the charm. Maybe? Oh, my chest piece. Never mind. Change the chest piece. Oh, even better. We have some ascendant blueprints for them. I, d I didn't even know. That makes my gear so much better now. I'm unsure what the Olympian buff is. I don't know if this is a new tier that was added or not. Wait, I'm still on four? Huh? Ah, Why is it? Olympian? 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 Just... I guess it doesn't want to work. Never mind. Okay, no Olympian. Okay, so we're back at it. This time we're not doing Primal Fear again. We've done Primal Fear way too much recently, and I'm not trying to burn that mod out uh, as well. Basically, every time we do play it, we just complete it within the first day. Well... Actually, we never really complete it. We just get like too much good stuff and then we just stop playing. But anyways, today we're back on Arc Omega. Now, I kind of just wanted to do a thing similar to the uh, 24 hours on modded video I did recently. Well, I just see how quickly I can get to end game in time and then uh, we'll upload it. Whether it be 24 hours, 48, 72, whatever. Let's just, just give it a go. And obviously this one, if you couldn't tell by the beginning, is also a 10x server low rate as well. So... Well, low rate for these types of servers, but um, this is going to be a long experience. So I guess I just start gathering all materials and everything. And so things had finally kicked off. After I gave myself a little tickle, I went around and started gathering myself some materials. I went to craft myself a pickaxe, but ended up finding out this mod actually gives you some starter tools. So that allowed me to just go around and grab some stuff. The tool can also switch between pickaxe and hatchet which I think is incredibly handy. But once we had enough resources, I'll just craft myself up a bunch of cooking pots and get myself familiar with everything this mod had to offer, which was a lot. There was explosions over here a minute ago. Oh, there's a body bag. Are you friendly? Oh. Anything special? No. Ah! I saw explosions. I thought it was like a rocket launcher or something. But it must have been a dino. They're gone now though. That's annoying. Once I thought I finally started getting a grip on things, I went over and tried to kill this dodo. As you know, you need hide to start off. But it turns out this thing was just invincible. So I went scrolling to see if there was anything that would give me a little bit of kick of damage. I found out you could craft some more workbenches and there was this spear that had infinite dura and you could just hit and use it as much as you want. But I came across a lystrobe that was spitting poison and I didn't want none of that smoke today. So I just dipped. Are those baby raptors? <laughs> Wait, there's like a whole pack following each other. Where'd they go? Well, they're just minions off like this this guy. What what type of raptor are you? Yo, 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 I'm friendly. He isn't. Eat him. Oh, eat him. Eat this guy. <laughs> eat him. Loads of stuff's just dying around me. I'm getting souls from it. Yes. Okay. Wait. Yes, I got some hide. Nice. Okay. That's all I needed. Yeah, I think when dinos of different tiers die around you in Arc Omega, they must just, like, drop the soul. Because I've gotten quite a few already. Elemental, ethereal, unstable, nature, mythical. Uh, mythical's got to be one of the top tier ones or something. Oh, okay. This bro made out of stone. <laughs> Wait, he looks like he's made out of stone. <laughs> That's bugged as hell. There's a base here. Had to go up higher to escape from this thing. I need to make some bolas. 
Are these like... Oh, reusable bowlers. Nice. <laughs> what? Um, you know what? This is a very sensible form of travel. <laughs> uh, everything's reusable in this mod, it seems. Parachutes and bowlers. I, <laughs> I do like my free bow, uh, range of transport, but I think I will have to hop off this guy. Otherwise, I'm just... Wait, can I kill him on it? Oh, yeah, no, that didn't work. I see if I can kill him anyway for the hide purposes. Bro's actually going to kill me before I kill him at this. Whoa! <laughs> Bro turned into a wyvern for a second. Need to remember his place. What? He's a diplo. You're a diplo! Stop! Oh, no, nah, bro. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna, I'm gonna die, bro. <laughs> that thing not dying. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go back up here and hide. Oh, my God. Help me! Oh my god! Where's this base so I remember? It's here? Okay. <laughs> Yo, can you go away for a second? Can you just... Yeah, thanks. Can I actually get a K mode here? Oh! They have loot. And they have loads of tames. This might just be a dino pen, though. A breeding pen? Is that eggs at the very back? In that little container? How much C4 do I need for this? It's already been damaged. Okay. I need to figure out the quickest way to get myself C4. And well, once I'd found the raid and something to do, it was time to start building my base, as I wouldn't be able to progress any other way. So we got to work. Okay, well, that... Oh, no, the Diplo's there. I was about to say it's gone, the one I wanted to kill. Got more melee damage now, and I've got more HP. So I'm just going to sit under this thing and poke it out, and hopefully I don't get poisoned. Is this thing immortal or something? Why is it not dying? I've been hitting this thing for so long. Why is it not dead? I'm actually confused now. Is it like... Is this thing got some buff that stops it from dying? Ah! Oh my god, there we go. Got it. Finally, loads of... There's a player. Um... He is so fast. Oh my god. Tribe of Dean the Knight. Okay. Well, I need to keep an eye out for this guy. I'm not going to attack him yet. I don't feel any need to. If he Does he want to raid this base? Is this his base? Oh, this is his base. Okay. We won't do anything for a while. We'll chill. <laughs> Poor guy, man. <laughs> he needs to be saved. If I get something, I'll pick him out and tame him. But he's just... I think he's stuck there for the time being. That is one of the coolest looking Brontos I've ever seen. A crystal Bronto. I wonder how you ta That's a cool Pteranodon as well. Self-destructive. Okay, I'm not going anywhere near that. I wonder how to tame that. I'm probably going to have to go through this thing and read. But we've got 9,000 seconds, I think, left of newbie, like, double XP. So I need to maximize it as much as I can. Okay, so I haven't touched this mod in a long time. So I'm kind of uh, a bit cloudy on everything. I'm sure it will come back to me soon. But just going through them, I remember the ethereal spear and, like, the set of gear you can wear alongside it being super OP. Now, that might have been because I was playing on, like, a 
a, a thousand X server maybe at the time, but I think I should make just make my way towards getting one of these. All I really need is the souls, and uh, then we're good to go. Uh, is there any way to get them? Soul, maybe? Nah, we'll just we'll just go out and get some. Uh, I think I'm going to pack up the base and just go move into that bear cave above now. Uh, probably not the best idea, as I just got this place set up, but I feel like that, that spot just is so much better than being right next to the guy I plan on raiding. And if he comes and raids me now, it will just give me more reason to want to raid him later on. So, uh, yeah, let's go move up there. Uh, well, at least check. Cave looks empty to me so far. Yes, it's completely empty. Okay. Ooh. Wait, bears? Come to me. There we go. <laughs> Just need to drop them down in the water for the time being. Yo, that's not the water. Yo! Okay. I think we're good for the time being. Nice. There's some metal and crystal down here as well, which helps me out. Wait, am I on pickaxe here? Yeah. This will help me out a lot. Nice little area. Once you get a few turrets down, this place will feel a lot more safe, but yeah, we're a bit poor right now. I think this server also has, if I'm not wrong, awesome, it does have awesome teleporters. I need to get myself one of those, but first I need to go grab myself some paste and everything. Okay, for me, the bear cave that was just up from the base that I wanted to raid was actually free. So I decided to move everything I had into this spot as it would give us much more space for later on in the video and just surviving in general. It is also pretty good at defending as on these types of modded servers, all you really have to do to protect your base is spam turrets. They don't have to have a turret wall. You don't have to have towers or cages. Just place your turrets on the floor and because of how OP they are, you're basically safe. But things were starting to look like home as we got down our workbenches, started storing all of our most important loot, and then we went out for oil and silica pearls as we would need them for both a fabricator and C4 later on. <laughs> Ow, I'm taking damage just by standing here. I've got some pretty nice souls from this. I'm just gonna... Ow, okay. Maybe if I can't get up high, I'm not gonna... Ow! Can they get up? Okay, I think I'm good. I'm gonna chill out and see if I can uh, collect some... Uh... How did you get there? <laughs> I... There's so much going on right now. I'm just going to leave. Oh, are you alive? Hello? Oh, you are. This guy shoots flame bombs. What? <laughs> I just want my electronics, bro. Give me these. Please. Didn't even get any electronics anyway. Never mind. After getting some disappointing loot from that raptor, I decided to go check one of the main bear caves. As some people on modded servers just don't have the idea to like break the back rock and make sure no one can come in from it. So I decided to just run in and see if there was anything in there. But to no surprise, the cave was abandoned. Doesn't look like anyone's built here. No, there's just bears everywhere. I'm guessing the people that are currently on the server, other than the guy I've met, are probably built in Pearl Cave. There's no way no one's not built there. If not, I'm taking that spot later on when I can. I would then start piecing up this parasaur in hopes of just getting some electronics or a bunch of Ellie dust for later on. But lucky for me, I actually got one of my first loot drops from this thing, which is insane. Ooh. I got given some of those gloves. Are they good? Uh, armor bonus when equipped. Well, our first little piece, that's nice. Okay, a 42k metal transferred. I think with the time I spent out, I managed to collect enough of these soul things. And now can I make an ethereal spear with this? Uh, no? Huh? Is that a normal spear? 
I get this one. Yeah, there we go. We've got an ethereal spear. Nice. Okay, that means infinite and the damage scales with melee and movement. This thing's going to be broken with uh, what I've got of both. Once my base was all finally set up, I decided to start using some of those souls and boss essences I had been gathering all those time from stuff just nearby dying. And if you didn't know, you can craft these little implants that actually have a chance to drop you some of the starter gear, which can end up being very nice. Okay, I've got a bunch more of these things crafted. Hopefully I can get some of the uh, the good ethereal gear set that buffs the damage of it. What's that? Eclipse chest piece? Enemies ignore you. No, to be honest, that's a good thing to have. It's a good thing to have. Uh, what about this? Sanctuary gloves? No. No. Why? And, okay. Well, to be honest, the gravity shirt kind of fun. Because I can just float around now. But the rest, that just makes me sad. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm not hanging around, bro. Okay. <laughs> what? Yeah, I'm not I'm not getting involved in that anymore. It started off as just wanting hide and then it turned into that, so why does this thing doesn't do as much damage as I thought it would. It's definitely a lot weaker. I need I need some buffs for this thing. A lot of them. Oh, it dropped something blue. What'd it give me? Ramshackle magic charm. I forget what these do. Uh damage taken. Oh, okay. They just give me some buffs. Nice. So, whilst we were off out venturing, I decided to grab myself one of the most important ingredients in Ark, and that was polymer. As, if you didn't know, you need it for basically everything mid to late game. On top of that, in modded Ark, a lot of the modded turrets and uh, craftables you have all require poly. So, it was always nice to grab some more, and I stacked myself on top of it. And once I got back to base, I started crafting myself some GP, as loads of the charcoal that I had had finally smelted, and then we could start looking towards crafting myself my first fabricator, and straight after that, a Weapon X workbench where we could also start crafting myself some of the OPC4 that comes alongside the weapons mod. I'm not sure what's going to win here. I kind of hope the wolf wins. No, the wolf loses so I can farm it, as I think those wolves are made out of obsidian, so that's just some free farm for me. But if it loses... Someone set up a turret just over here. So I can just lure it here and uh, use it to kill something. Oh, I got the wolf's attention right there. I'll just bring it over here. Oh, no. It ditched me and went back with her. Come here, mister. Ow. Oh, yeah. Oh, it dropped something. It dropped two things. Boots and a charm. Gravity boots. What do these do? Heal for full damage taken. Well, I'll take that. <laughs> That's huge, actually. What? No. No! Don't harvest it! Oh, oh, thank you. Oh, my God. No, I'm back for this algae, bro. It's being lured into these turrets over here. Come here, little fella. Yeah, over here. No. Bro, come here. Wait, where did my spear go? Did it despawn when you die? Wait, I lost like half my inventory. Wait, that's so stupid. Well, I'm getting metal at least, but... What happened to... What? Did it take it? Yo, come down! No! Well, that's not fun. Wait, it didn't kill it? This th <laughs> I would have never killed that thing at all. It actually took that much, that many bullets. Did it have anything? No, it didn't. That was kind of disappointing, to be honest. What is the deal with this base? Oh. Oh. Egg collector. This was, this was the exact thing I saw in that guy's base. Up over the top, top area where, uh, by where I live. Still grabbing pearls around. CBA to head to a normal pearl spot, but we can maybe go raid him. I kind of wanted to get some Taurus up first, but it might be time to be honest. Whilst just exploring around in the center, I ended up coming across this knocked out stone Tyrannosaurus Rex, and I wasn't too sure if the player was nearby. So I kind of just camped it out for a bit. 
not letting me go cane mode. But there is a, uh, a knocked out Rex there. Don't know what's happened with the server, but it's definitely not letting me go cane mode. And I really need to go cane mode at the moment. Huh. This is not good. The thing is with this Rex as well, it is tameable. It says they've knocked it out, so they're probably nearby somewhere. Where are these cords? I need to remember. I need to go grab myself some gear again, because apparently all my stuff despawned out of my inventory, and then come back. Take another little look and see what's going on. When I finally made it back to base, I had a bunch of metal ingots and silica poles that I could craft into electronics. And that meant I had finally gotten myself some of the Jones Photon Sentry Toes, which, if you didn't know, are basically a staple in the modded server community, with these turrets just hitting anything for like 100k to 2 billion damage depending on the HP of the dino. Okay, I mean, we don't exactly have much, but I think I'm just going to raid that base now. I need some more loot, and I feel like this is going to be a very quick shortcut to getting some. I just hope the guy hasn't been raided. If he's there, it's going to be a bit awkward, but I've got a sword and one bowler. <laughs> so, we'll see how things go. Okay. This is a lot better than the one before. Oh, this is his actual base. Here's tech turrets and stuff. All normal. Which might be bad for him. I need to be careful then. I don't want to blow into his dino pen. If this is his actual base. He's, what, are these just heavies and dinghies? He doesn't have any photon turrets. I don't think he knows about them. That's good for us. That's very good for us. Later on in the evening, just before I was about to log off for the night, I ended up stumbling across that raid. And so, I went back to base and grabbed myself a bunch of C4, then teleported myself there and also set up my own teleporter. So, if there was any chance of me dying, I could always teleport back with yeah, more stuff. I don't stuff. even know if this base is going to have anything in it. But it's... Of course, there's just stuff here. It's the first one I found that isn't just straight up... What? these his? No, they're not. It's the first one that I've seen, though, that isn't just straight up tech turrets, and that's actually doable at this current moment, so I guess we'll just blow through bit by bit, see how far these guys are built in. And if they actually have any loot, that'd be nice. Okay, wait, the scotch has stuff. <laughs> wait. Nothing aggressive. Okay, we're in. Wait, I think I hear him sleeping. Where is he? Here he is. What's he got? Just some cloth gear. Oh, wait, he has one of those compound bows. The scotch has some decent stuff. Nice. Are all his things unlocked? No, they're not. I'm actually going to have to blow into them, which is kind of a shame. Wait, this one isn't. Ah, it has nothing. Well, all the more reason to blow into everything. Why are you in here? Boom! Babby, haste. To be honest, I needed that, so I'm happy. Use some more paste if possible. Uh, spark powder. A decent amount of metal, nice. Is that, it's like that in every forge, I think? A lot of narcotics. Metal again. And the smithy. Ah. Uh, I mean. It's better than nothing. Uh, it's better than nothing. I can't really complain. Oh, two dodos. I don't know why he had two of those, but we'll, we'll take them. We'll take them. I uh, need to drop the Omega Workbench, and then it's just a soul machine back here, and then we're basically good, I think. A drop. Anything special? Just... Loads of dodos on a May wing. What? Most, confu <laughs> most confusing raid ever. He's probably done it for kibble and eggs and stuff. But it's, st it's still random. Kibble machine? Nice. We've got some... Oh, ethereal kibble. 
Wait there, that's kind of big. I need to find something to tame or make myself my own kibble fridge so it doesn't despawn. I think we covered all the loot though that's in the base, so we can dip from this first decent raid. Now that we had done our first raid, we finally had loads of loot that we could actually use. And for starters, one of the most important things we had was a bunch of boss essences and more souls. So we could start looking at crafting some of the top tier narcotics and look towards knocking out some really OP tames later on. But things weren't over yet, as I still needed some angler gel to craft myself a bunch of turret ammo. So I would end up taking out the Maywing and going out exploring for it. But it was very much short lived as this ended up happening. I just I just got shot by one of those turrets randomly. So I lost the Maywing and my kit. And because this mod decides to uh, destroy some of your stuff when you die, I'm probably not even going to get my kit back. Let's see. If I lose the C4, that'll be the... <sighs> I lost all my gear and the C4. The worst parts to lose. Okay, nice. Fun game. And the spear. Okay. Okay, nice. I didn't even bring a pickaxe to harvest this thing, so it's going to be a hatchet job. <laughs> they gave me 10k angler gel. Never mind. I don't have to farm that ever again. Take me back to base. So, lucky for us, I ended up finding myself an anglerfish just before I was about to log off for the night, which meant I could craft myself some of the battery ammo that I would actually require for the photon turrets, which meant my base was pretty much guaranteed to be safe as I logged off for the night. I'd also craft myself some of these AP auto turrets as these are also pretty good on any modded server you play as I'm pretty sure the whole point of them is they ignore armor and just do loads of flat damage. But before we logged off for the night, one of the weirdest things that has ever happened whilst playing on a server just took place. And um, you guys are just gonna have to see it for yourself. Um. There's, a, there's an admin in my base. He just gave me all seeds. And he's given me a tech generator. Um, I'm just... Um, he's giving me more. Oh, he gave me element. Well. I was just about to log off. Damn. Well, thank you. <laughs> what? Okay. So, to be honest, I'm not too sure what just happened. I'm pretty sure there's kits on this server, and the admin just came over to my base, saw I didn't have one or was using it, so he just dropped it to me. But honestly, I'm not going to complain, as since this server's a 10x and it's taking me forever, I'll take this reward and uh, just, uh, we'll just, uh, what do we do? We'll just say it never happened. That's someone trying to raid me now. I don't have a weapon to fight someone. I need to go grab something real quick. Are all these worked? Oh my god. Okay. Wait, we can look at that stuff later. Um, Someone blew open my gates. So I need to get something to kill them. If I hit them, maybe this crossbow will knock them out. I think that's going to be my best bet. And then I'll bring this sword as well. Alright, let's go have a look. What's that line? Well, it looks like they're no longer here. Didn't really seem worth it for them. Or maybe they died. Yeah, he did. One of them did die. Okay, well. I'll just repair the base and then we can start looking at making more. After the admin just randomly dropped us off a bunch of tech plots yesterday. My guess is it's a starter kit that we didn't use on the server. And he uh, felt bad. How much ammo have these got? Oh, yeah. These barely... These got... Like, didn't even get touched, man. We're good. We're good for the night. Bro, what is that noise? Is people... People are still trying to raid me or something? Like, what? What's going on? 
I'm just going to make some more ammo real quick and cap up my turrets as much as I can because I can't be leaving them open like this at the moment. The annoying thing is, out of every thing this guy didn't give me, I know I should be grateful because I just got given stuff for free, but he didn't give me the element one. But one of the guys in the cave has these tech plots and also has Ellie. So either he did a boss and just duped it all that way, or he got given those ones as well. Or he bought them, I don't know. Once I logged back in the next day, it was all hands on deck, as I wanted to juice my base up so much since all the tech crop plots had been duping stuff as I had been sleeping overnight. I also wanted to reorganize my entire base, as the layout was kind of sucky and someone could surely run for it or just wingsuit through it with some of the OP gear on. So I ended up switching up to Cliff Platts, well, the modded version of the Cliff Platts, and just placed them around to make sure to extend, like, I guess the surface area of my base so I could put more turrets everywhere and just um, feel, feel comfy, feel comfy. Okay, so I actually found something that might be able to let me raid that base early the tech one that we saw earlier on it's in potions and it's called a stone skin potion now i can actually craft some already which i'm just gonna do but there's two things there's an immortal potion which as it says makes you immortal for 15 seconds but you cannot attack so it'd be a good way to get into a base i'm guessing without dying i kind of want to test it on taurus just to see Love running into someone. And then there's also the stone skin one, which gives you 75% damage reduction. Now, I think if you're wearing a good set of gear, I could probably run turrets with that since I've got 3k HP. But both of these potions just, they, they intrigue me a lot. Now, that immortal one is very, like, interesting. Because if it does work, it means my base is also so easy to raid. And I regret doing this base spot very much. But I just, um... Yeah, I kind of need to find a base, and we need to go test it and see how it goes. Someone raided this? Seems like they have. Egg collector? It's just eggs. When did this get raided? Was that the noise I was hearing earlier on? Huh. I need to go check the actual guy's base. I just forgot where it is. I hope he hasn't been raided. I really hope he hasn't. Okay, we're just going to leave everything here. Where did I put the potions? They are here. Let's try the immortal one. And let's go back with some C4 and uh, see if this works. Wait, that wasn't enough damage. Well, this is made of stone. Okay, well, I've got to go back and get even more C4. I thought that would be it. Okay, please work. That's... Never mind. Um, a mortal potion. Oh my god, I drank it and now there's another gate. I'm going to have to go back and get another one. Well, that was a waste. It was finally time. We had everything prepared and this raid was in sight. Let's see how it goes. Okay, for research purposes, we're also gonna try the stone skin one now with just prim flag. I can't. I just soaked so much of that guy's base. What? Nah, that potion not even fair. <laughs> that potion's not fair. My base is so screwed. Oh my god. Wait, I need to make myself another one of those and go straight back. What was it called again? The stone skin potion. Do I have enough? I do. Okay. And there's no cooldown on these ones either. These stone skin potions. These are absolutely disgusting. I can't believe these are an actual thing, to be honest. But we need to uh, raid this guy. I guess it's about time. Ah, ah. Wrong bit. Okay, pop the potion first. It literally turned you into a... Ow. Um, I can't roll. Okay. Okay. There's some... Uh, we're having some technical difficulties. We'll get there. Mm. 
Okay, hopefully this time I can actually do it. This guy does have the photon turrets, but I think these iron skin potions actually, like, make them do less damage as well. Oh. Maybe not? <laughs> oh, yeah, no. Yeah, turrets on this server are just a bit weird, because with the immortal potion on, they literally, like, do no damage to you. There generally has to be some counter to this, or admins have to take it away, as, as you can see, I'm about to raid this base using this broken method. Okay, with the immortal potion, I'm gonna... I think you, you can actually, like, run in place one c4 and then die so if i can get enough c4 down i might be able to just break it but i think i'm gonna run out of stuff to be able to craft them soon so Ooh, hopefully it works please work i only did 700 did i actually drop the photon turret or anything no. Ah, that one turret is the last of my needs to get rid of. I need to figure out how to get rid of that thing or I'm not going to be able to raid this base. Maybe back to rocketing, I guess. Use immortal potion. Unuse rocket, I think. That's it. Okay, I think I found a good spot. Can I? Okay, I think this is work. This will work. I'm gonna be able to blow in this way. Have they got more tur. Oh, they have more turrets. Ooh, this is um. Ah! That's a yikes from me. <laughs> no. I need to drop the hat train. Oh! Ah! <laughs> okay. I'm still alive. I'm, st I'm still alive. Woo. Okay, this entire wall's down. Nice. Right, what does this look like? How's my gear doing? Gear doesn't break on this server, I don't think. I don't see any photon turrets. I see a lot of cannons. I see a lot of heavies. There is photon turrets. Okay. Right, well, back to the immortal potion strat. The most broken thing ever. This is just... It's beyond broken. This is actually beyond broken. I'm just going to be here and drop a lot of the turrets. Oh, well, I made... Why did I move? Why didn't... It's so... It's so dumb, though. So dumb. Not moving! <laughs> Okay, I've dropped it. I don't think I'm going to be able to make that run, am I? There's a photon turret looking at me. Right. Oh. Well, that box is open. Maybe I can drop them like this. Just quick peeking. Why is it not breaking, bro? That thing's immortal. Okay. Well, apparently photon turrets don't break. Hey, why can't I damage this? What? Oh, I am. It's just taking forever. Okay, well... I feel like it's smarter for me to still try and drop these photon turrets that are literally pointing at me. Ow, 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 ow! Stop, deck! I'm sorry! Just keep dropping this. Oh, oh my god, okay. Look at the disrespect on this. I'm just standing here like... And I'm in! 
<laughs> and just like that, we have raided our biggest base so far on Arc Omega, and it was quite literally as simple as just popping one of the potions in this mod. I feel like if I ever make an Arc Omega server, that potion is not being in this game. Well, this, that's for sure. If I can ban one thing, it's definitely got to be that. But, um, oh, there's two people in this tribe. Thank you. All right, let me just uh, drop this guy's Jenny real quick. And then I can actually look at doing other stuff. Oh, it didn't even go down. Never mind. Oh, what does this guy have in here? Anything special? Mech? Nice. Element. That's what we needed. Uh, element, arrows, crystals, tech doors. I guess we don't really need any of this stuff. Um, sap, actually, we could use with. Primitive chromatic boomerang. Okay. And a wake up potion. Oh, there's another player here as well. Oh my god. This guy was loaded. Okay. You had a tech cover sale as well. That's pretty cool. Uh, preserving bin. Anything? Eggs. I think I actually need the eggs for kibble. So I will take them as long as I can carry it all. I rock it there. Tech rep. Oh, that thing is 70k HP. Bro, I don't even think I have enough for this. I'm gonna have to like, I'm gonna have to do some trips. I didn't think I was gonna have to. Hey, do you guys have anything tech I can use on this base to break it? No, no tech rifles, no nothing. Okay, never mind. Well, thank you, thank you for all the juicy loot I've got. <laughs> I'm so toxic, man. That's my last rocket. I have one thing I have noticed on this server is people barely have good gear. Like, I've noticed that in the people that I've, like, fought and killed, I don't even, I don't even know that says quest scroll, okay. But yeah, I've just noticed that no one has, like, high gear, high quality gear. This guy's probably got the best stuff I've seen with these riot things, like, reflective, immune to collective and bleed damage. That's really good. But the rest of this, oh, no, actually, no, he has this, 2% passive health regen. That's kind of good. I just saw that. And legs, I guess. Wait, these guys... Are... I mean, none of it's good, per se, but this is better than what I had before, so I'll definitely take it. And they also have ultimate knockout arrows as well. These guys were loaded with everything. Wait there, let me just uh, make my inventory look a bit nicer now. So, I feel like with this server, if you just carry at least one immortal potion on you at all times... You basically just prevent yourself from dying, because if someone jumps you, you pop that potion and then run. You should have just run for your life, and you're basically good after that. As you, well, as you guys just saw me do. But we've still got a lot more to loot. We've got their vault and stuff, so I guess we'll jump back over there. All right, that should be everything down, though. Finally. Photons? You guys down? Yeah, okay, everything's down nice. All right, let me take out the... I think I've got to take out the ORP next. What was in this box? Oh, water jars? Why? Why is there such random stuff in a cooking pot with more water jars and paint? Huh. Okay, fair enough. Alright, reps down. Anything special? Ooh! A Mastercraft Photon Rifle. I have never seen one that high of damage, ever. That must absolutely melt things. And also 200 Ellie. Tech suit, shoulder cannon, some batteries, and uh, just resources other than that. Wait, this thing's actually kind of huge. <laughs> Wait, where's the where's the photon batteries? Wait, this is ammo, no? It uses no ammo. Wait, does not what's it use? Need the photon core. Oh, okay, we have photon batteries. I need these things. Okay, well, I can just craft those when we get back to base. We'll finish raiding this thing now. How long would this thing take to destroy? Oh, quite a while. Or for just reduced damage? Nah, I'll just rocket everything. Alright, what's in? Oh, okay! Alright, we hit the jackpot of their cryotanes. What is that? And Siren Overaptor. They've got a Bronto with loads of HP. An Over Female. Okay, just an Overaptor. Okay, someone's just summoned the god. Nice. We've got a Lightning Mammoth. Rex, we've got a car Corodontosaurus, but a friend that has a, a million HP. That's the most I've seen yet. Oh, and then there's an explosive spino. 
Okay, well, we're definitely taking all of these. Uh, well, we're trying some of these dinos. We'll throw them out of base and give them a go. What else is there in here? All of these uh, charms. Can't forget these. These are always good to have. More potions. Rockets. Any good blueprints? Trike. Nice. Ethereal spear. Raptor Paragon Soul. Feed this to a Raptor Soul to any Archimedes. Oh, 100% stat boost. That's kind of crazy, no? Right, there's some Defender stuff as well. I'll grab that. A bunch of Braft Armors. Okay, I didn't even know that was a thing on here. Crossbow. And then just some junk around. Okay, well, to be honest, I quite physically couldn't have asked for anything better of a raid. We literally got everything we needed. So I'm, I'm super happy with how this entire thing has turned out. Super happy. Now it's just uh, back to base, I guess. Oh, I just realized an ethereal spear kit. I didn't even notice that before. Maybe I ignored this part. Rampage potion. There's more shields. Uh, cloth. Basic help. They had immortal potions as well. That's uh, other people know about these things then. Journeyman net. <laughs> Why is that a net gun? Can trap 50. Oh, okay. Wait, that's actually better than the one i have now i need to use, see if that works on players because bowlers don't on this server there's a lot of extra loot in here though that i definitely could use primitive getaway orb that summons a spiritual oh we've had one of those before i just remembered nice well uh, <laughs> bro bro hit the jackpot and it was with an immortal potion because they're broken apparently the Omega work bench also had just a bunch of nice like, potion sedatives in it. Some more of those essences. Just a bunch of more stuff. Okay, that is the base fully looted now. 100%. So I can leave knowing we just did a juicy raid. Okay, let's have a look at this Kalka Odontosaurus thing. I want to see this. What are you like? <laughs> it's got sick colors as well. A really good saddle. So what's it? How do you use its ability? That's C spin. Wait, what is this one? Frenzy. Uh, there's frenzy. I can't see any abil special abilities on this one. Okay, we'll whack this one back in the cryopod. A lightning mammoth. Okay, this is what we need to check out. What does this thing do? How do you use? How do you use its lightning? That's a buff. There's got to be a button, though. Oh, God. Is it not keybound for me? I don't know how to use this thing. Use! Use lightning! Use lightning, mammoth! Oh! How do I do this? <laughs> how do you work? Um, Z, X, control, shift. Um, V? No? R? E? Okay, I give up. You're going back in the cryopod. Useless thing. Useless. He's spawning in some color, colorful tapajaras. What is this? A fairy tapajara. Okay, so Archimega, I haven't actually played much of. Uh, that's not a good start. Hello, Mr. Dilo. Well, what are you? This is going to be so rough. I can already feel it, bro. No. Oh, no, it's just spawning it. Oh, that's a cool looking carbo. It's silvery. I wonder how much I'm actually going to be able to tame in this video. Or if I'm just going to have to, like, find a raid and uh, do something. Oh, I got all my levels already. Okay, I'm going to level up. Okay, I've done my stats. I went 8.5, 3, 340, 300, 2, 2, 5k, basically. 520 melee. And I put as much movement as I could in this time. <laughs> we're so fast, but at least we're going to be able to outrun stuff and survive this time. What's going on over here? Who's going to win? Oh, not me, apparently. Now we got to do... Oh, okay. This, 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 this server has more anime skins. Oh, we got Kratos and Iron Man! <laughs> we got Kratos and Iron Man! We got Graves from League. Dude, there's actually... A... This, this is so random. What is that? I don't even know. Is there anyone else I know? I bet these are all like Genshin Impact skins or something. I don't know. I don't play that, play that game, but it looks very, very that style. Uh, let me get everything done, though, and then we should be good.
Anyway, to make our start a bit faster, I ended up using one of the server starter kits. It gave me a set of ghillie and some tools, so it wasn't too much and it isn't going to take away from the video. But once we had that kit, we farmed up a bunch and since the rates were high, we were getting loads of resources very fast. And once I had gathered enough resources, I ended up going around searching for a base location. Now, I usually build in some of the better base locations to not get raided, but since I probably wouldn't be returning, I decided to go with something a bit different is what we'll call it this is the biggest one can you can't build in this right, i'm building inside one of these for the video i don't care this is this is goofy as hell i'm gonna foundation drop it though otherwise we're gonna lose we're gonna lose out on a lot of space if i don't and two if you don't know what foundation dropping is just watch the footage in the background and let me explain it to you basically you place one foundation and then you place a pillar now, once the pillar is placed inside, if you put a foundation next to it or anywhere around it, if you get the uh, arc's kind of weird, but if you get the right angle, it should end up lowered. And once it is lowered, you can just place another one, pick it up, do whatever you need, and just rinse and repeat until you've finally reached low enough. Honestly, maybe I shouldn't explain stuff again. I feel like that was ter a <laughs> terrible explanation. No, I just want to remind you all, this is a this is a PvP server. And there is actually like 10 people on the server for once. I haven't found a dead server, so... I'm actually... I will. I probably will get raided. Maybe even in like in this video, if someone notices this. But if they don't, I'll still... I'll, I'll put a turret tower outside just to be... Far, like, just, just to meet... Oh, wait, you can break that for me? Wait, I didn't even know. Wait. Wait, I didn't even know that! Oh my god, you learned... So and they say you don't learn something new every day. I definitely do. I just, I just learned that. I think I understand why my character didn't work because I'm a female model. <laughs> and I've got to have a male model to be able to do it. <laughs> I am now cat girl in Ark. Oh my god, I've fallen off, bro. I've, I've fallen. Okay, at least, at least yeah, I'm kind of hot to be honest. What? I, I kid you not, I just heard some C4 go off. I, I heard C4 go off somewhere. I don't know how far away that was, though. Was it nearby? Is there a water? No, there's no waterfall here. Wait. Is there dinos that, like, drop C4? Or is that an actual raid going on? I didn't get to see if there was damage numbers or something. I probably could have found it. Oh, I think that tornado... That- that's where the C4's coming from! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what are those Deodons? No, not Deodons, Hyenodons! Oh my god. Wait, can I... Oh my god, but I got some hide. Don't, don't... Oh, quick, quick! Oh! Yeah, just- just quickly make a bed. I also need a double door to actually, you know, stay safe inside my thing. Maybe a wall or two. I need to get back to base, bro. I'm, I'm not safe out here. Oh, why does my base look so clean, man? Wait, how does... Can I fit? I can just about fit. <laughs> oh my god. This is so bad. <laughs> no. Someone's so... <laughs> Someone's gonna notice this. At fir the first thing, dude. Is there no newbie prot or something? <laughs> I'm so screwed. Let me get my beds down at least, man, before I get raided. Beds and some refining forges, I guess. We can get the get the craft going and the groove. Yeah, this is this is what getting my groove on is is like an arc. Basically just placing placing refining forges and uh mortar and pestles, making it so I can actually progress in this mod. But at least we had a base and somewhere safe, unlike the last mod we tried where we was prim locked for hours. Oh my god, if I wasn't playing on Fjorda, that would be such a cool thing to use. The Omega Raft. It gives raft armor, it gives custom slots for upgrades, inventory. If I, if I go to open water, I'll definitely try one. I do need one of that, though. A reusable spear. I'm trying to think. Is there anything new that I need? I've got reusable bowler already and parachutes. I'm just looking for the, the necessities. I don't think there's much here. I just need to get myself a smithy and fab going. I've already got those crafted. Make a workbench. Yeah, I think I'm good. Okay, I don't know what these workbenches are for, to be honest. They take up most of the space in my base. What is this? A um, imbue workbench. Place equipment. Click on the equipment. Oh! So if I put this... 
Oh. Well, that's not as easy as I thought it was then. Put that. Click. <gasps> oh. Um. Um. I'm, I'm going to have to read into this a bit more. I don't know what to do. This looks cool. The Omega Workbench. Thieves Pendant Skin. Equip this skin on any of them to make... Okay, to be honest, that is good. I like that. I need that because uh, Pegamest X ruined me a lot. Oh, okay. So with the essence I've crafted that's just been... I don't even know where it's coming from. I think it's spawning in in my inventory. Well, can I... Early set token. Oh. You know what? We will craft one of those. Let me see what I get. This might actually be useful. It's kind of like gambling. Let's have a look. Give me long neck. Oh, okay, wait. Why is there so many buffs? I'm trying to read this. Uh, um, can I can I imbue? Um, uh, 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 I don't know. All right, I'm gonna go out collect metal. Pay. Oh, another another shiny one. What you got? Oh, blue. What you got? Oh, that's nice. That is nice. Okay, but bases... Well, base should be fine, I hope. I'm gonna leave this gacha bro to, to farm and do things. What'd you give me? Oh, more stuff. Anyway, we need metal paste and uh, stuff for a fab, so I'm gonna go do that. Okay, yeah, I think I get given these little old things as time goes on throughout the server. I'm not sure if that's, uh, that seems pretty broken. I feel like these are quite hard to get, but, uh, it'll be helpful. It'll be helpful. I don't know. What is this? Dino Retrieving Terminal. Bro, some of this stuff is confusing me. Oh my god, there's a big, there's a big, oh my god, there's a, there's a big page. There's a lot of reading to do. Oh no. Me and Ray, uh, reading? I don't know if it's hand in hand, to be honest. I'll, I'll give it a little what I call the blur skim through. Oh. Well, no one's built in there. We could have built in Helm's Deep again. That would have been... That would have been better, but I like my little cozy shack. I feel like I build in the same generic base spots every time, so... We're gonna live in, yeah, a little hobbit hole. Okay, we've cleaned this. I don't exactly need any elements, so I'm not going to craft any of that. I don't. Do I even have element unlocked? Tech. No. Tech's not unlocked, so no point. Oh my god, this place is literally a war zone. Oh, he's dead. Do you have anything special? Oh, bro, you. This ain't like Primal Fear. You get given the top, top stuff if you kill these guys. Well, at least I get some more hide. Whilst I'm out and about, I've grabbed... I've tried to grab anyway. Most of the resources I'll need. Like I've got sulfur. I've, I've grabbed myself some cactus sack. Sack? <laughs> cactus sack. <laughs> I've grabbed myself some cactus sap, nameless venom, uh, charcoal gems. So, uh, yeah, I've just grabbed as much as I can. The only thing I'm missing is pearls and poly, and then we're good. Why? Found a chest. A hoarder chest. I need basic essence. That you need a lot to open that. This thing better give you like the best of the best loot, man. What? Can you not? Can I not break it somehow? Not cheese it? No, there's no way. Well, that's something to work towards opening. Oh, nice! We finally have enough uh, of the stuff to make the the super spear thing. I need one spear. I grabbed it. So what happens? A spear imbued with ethereal power cannot be broken, can be infinitely thrown, isn't affected by gravity, thrown damage will scale with both... Ooh, okay. Now, if this thing bro... Why is it invisible? <laughs> Why is it like that, bro? Why is it like that? If this thing breaks, I'll be very upset. But let's, um... 
Let's go give this thing a go, shall we? Let's try test. Actually, no. Our friendly Gatch is giving us stuff. He can he can live here rent free. Let's find something. This parasaur, you say? All right. Let me bowler my my bo my dear sir. He is le All right. Let's check. Max charge. Boom. Oh, okay. He actually does quite a bit of damage. Wait, if I go th further back, does it do more? No. Okay. Th how much does that do? One twenty. Okay. You're better off just like. Throwing them non-stop, I guess. Oh my god, I accidentally hit the gacha. Now I've got a gacha on my case. Oh my god, this wasn't worth it. Yeah, I feel like this weapon's bad. I don't know why. I need to I need to find something better for this mod. I'm trying not to search up anything. <laughs> oh no. I'm trying not to search up anything. Hopefully we find some star hello. I didn't even film this thing killing it because it took me so long. Just look at the amount of spears I put into this thing. There's actually more, but I think they started despawning. Okay, that. Uh, well, that's that's a lifesaver. I was worried I wouldn't get electronics out of it. I'm not gonna lie, but that solved my. Um... Oh, I didn't even need electronics. I just realized I need a polymer. What am I doing? Why is there a tech bubble? <laughs> Did someone placed the tech bubble. Is that like a? Is that like an ability of something? I'm dropping down, I don't care, I need to check this. It doesn't look too, too friendly. Is that something? What is it? Oh, it's gone. Is it? Is it you? Oh my god, it's you. You're the thing that's doing the shield. That's cool. I also kind of want to try this boomerang. <laughs> it, it imbues it with an elemental soul, causing random element status effects, blah, blah, blah. And it scales with melee, basically. So I just whack a bit of that in there. Don't have any, don't have any fibber. Yeah, we got ourselves some fibber. Let's put our uh, fibber in here. All right, we've now made another one of the weapons of this mod. And we've also got... Wait, wait, wait a second. No, not yet. Wait, wait a second. No, wait. Wait, wait, wait two seconds. You're still here. Uh, wait, wait, wait two seconds. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, okay, and now we also have a t <laughs> we have C4 and a detonator now. Woo! <laughs> right, does this work like an actual just arc boomerang? Wait, let me have a look. Let me have a look. <laughs> it's rainbow. <laughs> oh! What's it do? Hello? What are you doing now? What the? Oh! <laughs> what? <laughs> what the? Oh! oh my! This mod also has a bunch of potions that are like. I don't know, they just seem so OP. Gain a 100% magic find. I don't know what that does. Protects you completely. I don't know how long they last for. What else is there? Uh, night vision. That one just seems so good for running some caves. Siren. Makes nearby enemies go passive. That's kind of cool. I'll definitely keep that one in mind for taming. There's a bunch of stuff on it. Oh, wait. Nah, bro. This is bro broken. <laughs> why, can I, why can I make a kibble fridge? Wait. Give me some, give me some metal ore real quick. Alright, let me make... Where was it? Structures? Yeah, look, I can make a kibble fridge. It's not... <laughs> it looks like a vending machine. They're so cool. What's this? Is there anything else special in here? A totem? No. Uh... Uh... Ooh. Will cause a god to hatch. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. I'll just stick to my, um... My kibble vending machine that we're gonna place right here. Oh, yeah, that's way too close. What? Hey, there we go. Oh, wait, you can craft kibble as well. Oh, okay. We need to start farming stuff. Eventually, though, I finally got to grips with the mod and started crafting myself some of the good torpor items in this mod, such as the really strong 8x narcotics you can make and then turning them into arrows, which have a bunch of other buffs on them as well. One thing I have noticed about this mod is a lot of items and different things that come from Omega have like back, not backup stats, but like extra hidden stats to them that just like make them even better. So make sure if you play this mod, you pay attention. 
Once I'd figured that stuff out though, I started crafting myself cooking pots, campfires and other things to make sure I could start making kibble soon. And then I went out to explore as I really hadn't seen much of the mod yet. I ended up coming across dinos that could spawn lightning from the sky and other ones that were just freezing me as well. I was literally getting tag teamed by two dinos. This is, this mod is crazy. And I also came across golems and carnos fighting and one of these, these carnos were made out of metal. It's, it, I, I don't know what to tell you. I found my first sign of life. Just a couple of foundations. <laughs> I don't know if this is a good or bad thing, bro. I don't know what to do. I've been searching for ages now. There's, I'm, uh, I'll keep my hopes high. There's bound to be something. I'll start teleporting to other other places soon, though. What is this? <laughs> what? 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 What do these? What do these do? Has someone placed these? They must have. Okay, well that's a good sign. Maybe there's someone built around here somewhere. Yeah, there was no one built around there. But, in good news, I went back to base and I managed to get myself my first auto turret. And then, after that, my first heavy turret as well. Meaning our base had a little... I can't take myself serious, man. My, our base had some protection, but this is this is this this is getting raided by like a grenade or something. This this ain't surviving like a couple hours. Oh, someone summoned one of the OP gods on the servers. So there's definitely people like there's quite a few people on. I think there's ten people on the server at the moment. But I just I feel there's such a big map. Like I just can't find anyone. Oh. <gasps> Well, my luck just, um, <laughs> my luck just turned around just as I was ranting about how uh, rough this is. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, just as I was saying that, what is this? A little, just a, just an average rat, just a random tech base. Like what? I'm, I'm so getting raised, bro. Where are these people? Oh. Bro, don't tell me I've only just found like a foundation. What? This is... This is it? I've been looking for so long! And this is the... Wait. Oh my god, that's a player. Um... Um... He's got a long neck out. Is he trying to kill me? I don't know. I kind of want to try and kill him. Where is he? Yeah, he's shooting me, I think. Oh my god, wait. I've... Oh, no, no, I just got weapons. Oh my god, no, this guy's actually chasing me. He's out for me. Okay. Where'd he go? Wait, he's trying to trank me! Oh my god! Well, I think there's two of them actually. Oh my god, wait, why is the server started lagging? What the fuck? It's so. It's so. It's so laggy. Oh, I didn't even make myself a whip, but that's the biggest issue. I see one of them, though. Okay. Well, that lasted very long. <laughs> that lasted very long. I just got two bit, bro. By a, can I can I get my package? Ah, uh, well, my body got looted. <sighs> I'm gonna go blow up their base. 
I need to, I need to, <laughs> I need to do this now. It's giving me a purpose on this server. Honestly, I was going to log off for a bit and take a break, but... Now, nah, after that, man, I'm getting a whip. I'm getting a full kit. Oh, what I can make. I'm just going to get myself together. Yeah, I was not making that mistake again. I made sure to make the OP whip and the torch of this mod. Huh. I might craft that. I just need some metal and paste. I don't know. It's like a... It might just be a get out of jail card for me, that, that thing. But honestly, it looks so good. It has different modes. I think I was reading. Wait, where is it? Grenades. Yeah, this one. Not the... the there's a storm one, but this one is... Uh, a powerful grenade with cosmic powers. Expensive. Blah, blah, blah. Whatever. But it has supernova, starfire, singularity, and meteor. So... I could also use a vacuum, though. Hmm... You know, let's do, let's do this one. Alright, let me check how much damage this torch does real quick. Oh, okay. Wait, I feel like that will actually shred some... Oh, that will actually shred some players. So, I'm just going to pick up more of these and maybe I'll get something good. Why is this such an OP combo? I've got a jetpack on and I've got a wingsuit. Where did I... Where did I see those guys again? I can't... I think it was over here, wasn't it? Yeah, it was in this direction. Well, I would... I think they've moved. I think that base is in here. Yeah, I think this is where they're built. I can't lie. Oh my god. Is this... I don't know if this cave has two entrances, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not too well versed on this spot. I'm gonna go check the other side just to be safe. But yeah, I think they picked up... They picked up their stuff. It's no longer here. But there is a big tech base thing here, though, so it's a good sign. I might die here, but I'm just going to check it. 1c4. What? Hello? C4? Can I... There you go. What? What? Bruh! Oh, is it taking damage? The damage number's just not on. Oh my god, I thought I was getting scammed. Alright, let's place it all. Screw it. Oh my god, it actually takes so much more C4 than I expected. Oh my god, getting through here is going to be painful. Give me good loot. Give me, give me good loot. Hello? Give me good loot. Oh, good loot. Okay. There's actually something worth being excited about. It's not over yet. The dream is not over. I had time to see if farming off all this. I thought it had been repaired then. Farming up all this C4 will be a waste. I don't know how much this is going to take. I honestly thought this would be 6x. And I'd go through it a lot quicker. But apparently not. I'm just going to place 7. Still not down. One. Let's do 4. Let's just do 3 actually. Oh. 1. One more. <laughs> oh my God. One more. Oh my god, finally. Hello? Oh, don't tap. Really? Someone blocked this off and put nothing in here. What? What is the point? What is the point? This is like the first sign of life I've seen in a bit. What's this? Looks like it's been raided. Absolutely de destroyed this thing. Oh my god. Dimensional storage? I didn't even know that was a thing. Well, the thing is, if this guy got wiped this easy, imagine what they're going to do to my little my stone shack, bro. 
<laughs> this tech base got wiped. Probably didn't have Tyrus, to be honest. I didn't even know there was awesome teleporters on this. And there's tech crop plots, I think. Okay, we need to we need to find bases, man. There's there's gotta be stuff. Another base spot that's been not used. Yeah, someone should just spam this out, and I don't think they've actually touched the cave. <laughs> he's, st he's still logged out here on the bed. <laughs> I'll take your set of gear, bro, even though I could get this for free, but this ain't this ain't too convincing on my part. Can I break this? Oh, well, oh, I'm using 1C4 on the foundation. I doubt there's even anything in... Hello? Please work. There you go. Anything? Yeah, to be honest, I didn't know what, what, what I didn't know what to expect. This is this is my hope levels are going down and down. Here is what I was looking for. Someone has built here. Is there a turrets? Oh my god, my base, this base, I'm lagging. Right, let me have a a look around. I just, I don't understand this server. I really don't. People be putting stuff everywhere just randomly. But like, there's no bases. It's just teleporters and like a couple boxes. I'm, I'm, I don't know. I'm just going to keep looking and try and uh, check everywhere, I guess. I've got to, before I give up. Wait, someone knocked this out recently. I wonder if I can camp it and see if they come back. I need to find somewhere to hide. Alright, well, I hope this guy's not showing up. I've been here for like 20 minutes. I'm just going to ruin his tame and uh, go figure, figure something out, I guess. So, I think this is a good place to end off the video here. Let me know down below what you guys thought. Also, I will mention, in this video, I barely even scraped 1% of this mod. There's still loads of armor sets, weapons, and I didn't even get to tame any dinos. So, if you guys do want a part 2, you guys know what to do. Just hit the like button, and if there's enough of you saying you want a part 2, I'll definitely do one. But anyways, take care everyone, and I will see you all in the next video I upload. There's one thing I haven't looked into doing much of, is this thing. The item, the item fragmenter? So I need to imbue items. I want to upgrade my leggings to better ones. As well as that, I want to see if I can change these. I haven't tried it yet, but to do it, as I said, you need set fragments. And I think the way you get that is by... My guess is like breaking this down. I'm not too sure. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to whack a bunch in and we'll have a look. And if you do want to learn more about it, I recommend watching a video. But in short, there's different things you have to break apart to get different type of essences. And I managed to figure out all of that. Well, I say all of them. I managed to figure out most of them. I also finally, to your guys' uh, much surprise, made myself some kibble on the mod. So we can finally start looking towards taming some of the dinos and not just raiding for them. As that seems to be a, uh, a recurring theme in these uh, modded mini series that I do. But once I had everything done and out of the way, I logged off for the night, and we move on to the next day. Okay, we are back again on the uh, Primal Fear Arc Omega server. I think I thought of the uh, the best title for that video today. I tried Primal Fear Omega. I think I think that'll do pretty good. But yeah, we got a lot of stuff to do today. Oh. Uh... Uh, my turret is still doing its job. I need to... What I want to do is I want to set up a turret tower out the front to make sure I can't get raided even more. I'm not sure if it's going to show in Triblog. We did have... Yeah, we had a few people come scout our base. They insta-died as they walked in. But I kind of just want to make it even safer. As uh, as you know, if any of you watched the video yesterday or whenever I released it, the, the one before this, I managed to raid a base with loads of photon turrets. Now, they didn't have autos. We do. But I would say, yeah, we need at least one turret tower here or something. I don't know. This tech suit is annoying, man. But yeah, no, we got some stuff to do. All right, what sort of kibble did I get? So I have Prime Guardian kibble. I have Toxic kibble. I have Summoner kibble. Uh, and I have this kibble. How long does it last in my inventory? Am I good? 
23 hours. Yeah, okay. I think I'm going to take this out and see if I can find some dinos to tame. We have a lot of good arrows to knock stuff out with. We can also make some more if we really need to. Do I have the... Uh, uh, where are they? Narcotics? Yeah, we got those. And now I just need some... Uh, like tame, tame starver thing. I'm sure I have some somewhere. Mixing the primal fear stuff in. Here we go. Reduces uh food. Yeah, we get these two. All right, sweet. I think I'm managing to cheese this boss. I don't know what mods this from. It might. This mod might be from Primal Fear. I'm not too sure, but look, look just look. It, I, I think the spear is applying just effects to him, and he can't move. And I've got four pieces on, so I'm doing, like, the 200% bonus damage. If I hit, like, the six-tuple multiplier, I do, like, 11 million damage or something. I'm going to see if I can hit it again in a minute. Yo, you need to you need to back off, bro. Oh, there we go. I hit an 11 million. This thing still has... I, I wonder how much HP this thing has, because I've hit two 11 millions, and it's, like, I don't know, barely taking away anything. I'm going to be here for a little while longer, I think. Yeah, bro, this server is just, like, the melee is boosted so much, but this spear is broken with, like, f just four pieces alone. Look, it's, it, it's just perma, like, slowed. He can't, he can't turn, use his abilities. I'm just poking him down this entire time. It does take a while, don't get me wrong, if you don't get the damage multiplier. But, to be honest, you basically one-shot everything. Oh, there we go, and it's dead. You basically, <laughs> you literally one-shot everything. Oh, nice, the good potions, everything around you. How do I just have, like, two different conversations with myself? Oh, I think I found something. Oh. It's a lot of turrets. I have quite a lot of rockets on me, so... Ooh. <laughs> are these... Wait, have they got heavies as well? I think they do. What is it? Is it heavies and photons? Or is it just heavies? I think it's heavies and photons. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah, this is this is a big raid. Oh my god, man. I wouldn't know how to do this. This is... Oh, jeez, bro. In all honesty, you probably could rocket run from an extent. Could you damage the shield from up here? I wonder. Just to check real quick. Oh, it's gone. Oh. There's one rocket. Um, <laughs> what? Right, I need to go back to base. I'll come back here. Damn, they have a lot of stuff. Since I blew the uh, the bubble, there's a lot of aggro dinos in there. I think with a full set of tech, I might I might just be able to run in and grab some stuff. Well, not grab some stuff, like drop a lot of the turrets since there's 6x in there. So we'll just have to see. Alright, I got myself that there. Should be able to just retrieve my corpse. I'm not going to be too worried about running in there. I don't think they're online. If they are, this is a very big mistake. But, um... Have I got my full tech set on me? No. Legs are, like, the most important part. <laughs> what am I doing, bro? This is so dumb. I might be able to angle it, to be honest, if I get in a... In a good... Oh, in a good enough spot. Oh, we dropped one. To be honest, that's more... Oh, no, we dropped quite... Oh, my God. What? <laughs> I'm not the only one seeing this, am I? Look at this. This is a tunnel, man. It's an absolute tunnel. Okay, now nah, we can do this raid. 100% we can do this. Hopefully they don't steal my body before I spawn back in. Oh, nice. I got my body. All right, I'm going to save myself the... Uh, oh, well, I was being raided then. I'm going to save myself the panic and only bring my rocket launchers with me. And uh, we're just going to do the raid this way. Ain't no way we're raiding this base location, bro. Raiding on this server is too easy. My base is so easily raidable if this is the case. 
I need that, that turret tower and everything pronto. Hello? How much did we drop? Hello? Okay, we dropped quite a bit. To be honest, because of the way this, this base is designed, you actually can, like, ignore quite a lot of the, uh, the turrets. Oh, uh, see, there we go. Like, half the turrets are, turrets are blocked. This is, this is actually very bad for them. <laughs> this is, this is awful for them. We're even further in now. Oh my god, look at all the bags. This run-up's gonna become harder and harder. <laughs> oh my god, right. As soon as they click onto you, you die. But if you can make it there before they do, you can obviously blow, blow up so much. We doing good? Anyone online? Doesn't look like it. Did I drop it? <laughs> I think I'm inside their base. <laughs> I don't think I actually made it. Oh my god. Okay, this is going to take a few more tries. There's going to be a few more. Oh, wait. I think these are just photon turrets left. What am I doing? I can just, uh, <laughs> I can just shoot a rocket from a distance. Sometimes forget I actually, uh, I just don't have a brain, do I, sometimes? Boom. Oh my god! Run! Ah! I'm, 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 I'm sorry! I'm sorry, Tyranodon! Oh my god, help! <laughs> he's just, he's just not calming down, is he? I need to, uh, not get hit, because I don't know if this thing's going to one-tap me or not. Oh my god. I don't think the Tyrandon killed me, so I think I'm good. That was actually kind of lucky. But there's more turrets. So, yeah, this is going to be a bit longer than expected. Ow, ow, okay. A lot of heavies, nice. Just what I needed. How much ammo did these have in them? Oh my god, they actually had, like, all their... F every... star. Oh, okay, no, they don't have much ARB. But all of their photon turrets were, like, basically capped by the looks of things. Uh, oh. Yeah, see, 104k down. Bro, how, how am I doing this? So, it's safe to say this raid wasn't going to be as easy as I thought. Having turrets inside and a whole bunch of aggressive dinos, not only that, they weren't normal dinos, they were like the top of the line Arc Omega modded dinos. I literally couldn't do anything. I made a few mistakes though running in there and dropping loads of loot that would certainly despawn later on. But, since I was in a bit of a pickle and couldn't do anything, I would have to think fast on my feet. And that's where this idea came to mind. A bit of an unusual one, to be honest. You know what? I have an idea. A very... A very smart idea that I should have probably thought of before. Let's use the, um... Let's use the photon turret, shall we? Let's see how these bad boys go. Honestly, I don't even know how this is gonna work. How close can I place? Right here. Yeah, I'd say here's a good spot. <laughs> I'm actually gonna have to <laughs> like block this thing. Oh, I didn't bring any gasoline, did I? Of course I didn't. Okay, the test to see if this works now. Finally commencing. Probably isn't. If it does, well, actually, no, I say it isn't. It's gonna see how much damage they can do, to be honest. Uh, yeah, no, we got enough ammo to basically fill all of these. Hopefully it shoots in the cave. If not, I should be able to just push it up and kill everything that way. But I just want to get this done, man, before I lose them all. That's really the, um, the plan. Uh, medium, uh, survivors or tamed creatures, copy settings, all turrets, blah, 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 blah. All done. Hey, right, you're in. I think everything's going to despawn by now. I'm not going to lie. I don't know if the turrets have managed to do anything. I keep crashing in this base and just, I don't know. Things are rough. Did they? What are the odds of that? What? What are the odds of them having an Arthur Pleura? 
<laughs> I'm generally curious. What are the odds of that happening? I... Ah, <sighs> well, if I'm honest, a lot of the loot is going to have despawned now. Well, if I did manage to blow off anything anyway. I'm still going to get in there, though. I'm just going to have to set up... I'm going to have to come back with a proper kit and set up, like, a high up one so they can't break it. Is it... I think it's working. Oh, no, don't let the Arthur Furry get up to them. Oh, they're doing so much. Yeah, no, dude, look, look at this. I would not have been able to raid this one bit. Is it, is it breaking them? I think, I think I'm just going to come down here and see if I can come down. Try not be in hit range, though. Look, that thing is taking, my, one of my turrets are just spinning in circles. Oh, I'm out. Of well, I'll run it. Wait, is that run out of Ellie? Wait, what? No. Well, what does this thing have? Oh my god, bro. <laughs> Look, it's not even dead. <laughs> is this stuff still alive? Oh my god, they're not going to be able to kill that thing ever. Nah, don't hit me, bro. I'm out of this. I just... I died. Bro, I had all my stuff on me. I, I actually had... Oh, am I still dead? What? Bro. Hello? Game? Okay, never mind. I guess I just can't play. I think I think the server's gone down. I'm not going to lie. This is um this might actually be interesting if it works in my favor because if it rolls rolls back a little bit, I might have still I might still have my stuff, you know? Alright, let's have a look, shall we? Please don't be dead. Ah! Wait, how far did this roll back? Um... Wait. Oh my god, wait, my bags are still on the floor. Didn't I pick up these ammo? I, I can't remember. Wait, how... Oh, bro, how, how long ago did this roll back? No... <laughs> what has happened? Now, I'm not usually a fan of server rollbacks, but this one couldn't have come at a better time because it saved a lot of the stuff I had lost previously before the rollback. And on top of that, it gave me a few more chances to build these mini turret towers to destroy... Well, to try and, try and destroy all these dinos, man. Well, let's see if this works. Oh, that doesn't reach, really. I'm going to have to extend this cable out a bit longer then. Maybe that'll reach them. Too far? Oh no, it does reach him, sweet. I just... Is that thing like a reflective dino? Is that why it's breaking everything? Because I'm, 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 I'm having a hard time. Real, like, why it's breaking all my stuff instantly. I'm guessing it is. I don't know, man. All right, I got a full set of defender. Let's just see if I can reflect it and kill it. What? Mark on it. Bat. Bat. What? Oh my god, I think I... I currently have one turret fighting a celestial griffin. That pygmy thing's there as well. I mean, if it destroys the generator, that thing's going down. I don't know what's going on, to be honest. I'm just going to sit and watch from a distance. God, this raid has been so much harder than it should have been. Can you... No, don't shoot that thing. Shoot the other one. Oh, my God, bro. Oh, my God, it's on it. I'm guessing it destroyed the cables. 
Oh no, he destroyed the generator and hull. Nice. Oh well, everything here is gonna die. Oh! No, I actually killed the griffin. Finally, man. Oh, all this loot, finally. Wait, is this the thing that kept killing me as well? Oh, it is! I got my loot back! Nice! Well, that's sort of, well, not really sorted. I've still got all of this to do, but I think, how do I get away with, what, what do I need to do next? I need to figure this out. I'm just happy I got my original kit back. But now, oh my god, that's not good sound. Now we have a lot more, we can actually do stuff now. <laughs> We're not just stuck. I need some uh, more rockets, I think. Oh, nice, we got all our rockets back. God, we finally cleared everything out, but to be honest, I doubt there's much loot in there. My guess is a lot of it despawned over the time that I've been taking, like, doing this. They start shooting? Nice, they can. They can hit it. Sweet. Right, well, I'm just going to leave that to go then. Was the... Oh, was that him dead already? I think it was. Is there anything else in there that's going to kill me? Probably. There always is. I just... Ah. I don't even know if I'm going to make this, but I'm going to try and just run it one more time. See how I do. Oh. Oh, he made it a little closer. Nice. I feel like I dropped a lot of their loot. Bruh. This... Let's see what it does, if I can block the turrets and actually not die. I feel like this should work. I'm not being shot. Hello? Hello? Housekeeping? Okay, we didn't break most of the base. There's actually still going to be some, some loot here, at least. Hello? Hello, turret? Oh my god, this... So, we finally made it in the base, but we still had to be very careful, as we wasn't sure if any of them were online. As well as that, there was still a bunch of photon turrets and heavies at the back, so I would need to drop them all before I could really start looting anything at all. Oh nice, this guy has uh, been taking all my stuff hostage as well. Literally robbed me blind. Look how much stuff is in this guy, oh my god. All my tech suits, my ammo. It wasn't that mine as well. I don't know. I can't remember. Where's this Jenny? Are you on aggressive? You don't seem to be. Alright, where's this tech gen then? Hello? By looking around the base, like, you can see a lot of the ceiling stuff seems to have gone. Hello. Hello. Oh, oh, hello. Oh, hello. There's the gen. I found it. It's just one rocket, but I might die to this thing. Oh my god, bro. I need to just try and get it. Bro, I didn't didn't drop it. I thought it would. Anything? Oh, mushrooms. Nice. This guy had like the duping tech crop plots. Let's make sure I'm not losing out on any of this loot that I started. Well, most of it I feel like I have missed out on, but as long as I can get the important stuff, I think we're good. Oh, it's just a player's body. Oh my god, he had some good gear. Wait, he's got 7,000 like, knee 7k element on him. Why? This guy's absolutely stacked. Oh my god. <laughs> can I take all? I need, to, I need to clear up my inventory. Stone tools. Oh my god, I need to I need to make space. I, I feel like if I take all, I'm gonna get stock, stock capped. Yeah, I did. Um, can I make some space? Drop the arrows. I feel like I need most of the resources. Bomb. Um, deposit all of this good good. All the essence and everything. Oh my god, I got loads of kibbles as well, bro. This is mwah, mwah, so worth it. So worth it. I don't know if I'd get top of the line kibble. That's probably a bit too much. But look at this essence, man. We have like all of it. What about souls as well? Soul. Oh, bro, this is... We're, we're, we're alpha. We just are. And we got photon turrets back. Nice. These little vault things are actually saving me for storage right now. <laughs> They're actually saving me completely. 
All right, let's go back. Oh my god, what? Give me that. Back what I what I put into this. There's no doubt about it. It was so worth it raiding this in the end. I can actually upgrade my entire base now of all this too. This is so huge for me. So huge. And it goes down even more, bro. If they've I don't know if they've built down there. Or it's just like dino storage. Because I saw some dinos, but I didn't see really any wreckage of a base. So we'll see. we get in the final uh, final couple of things it's just this really babby uh oh nice compound bow that is really nice what about this anything oh this is like their primal fear workbench oh it literally is primal smithy yeah that's a, that's a that's a nice chunk of loot what about you the item fragmenter i think this is the last thing we have oh wait i'll drop something here as well oh, that's just wood bro oh it didn't drop oh Ah, wait, that doesn't look like anything too special. Okay, well, I think we have cleared everything here now. I'm just going to go around. Oh, wait, we got this. Oh, wait, what a soul can... Bro, bro, that didn't even break. I don't even have any more... <laughs> okay, I'm out of rockets now. I feel like we lost out on getting a lot of their tames. I'm not going to lie. But I feel like a, a lot of their tames were just uh, lost because of how long it took me to get into the base. But to be honest, we made it out with more than enough loot. More than enough. I just need to check below and make sure there's nothing down there and then we're good. Oof. Oh, his eggs and stuff. Wait, there is stuff down here. There's a bunch of teleporters. Oh my god. It hasn't ended. <laughs> is this where their actual base is? Wait, are you on aggressive? Oh my god, wait, they actually have loads of stuff on aggressive here. Um. Oh, this looks like a whole different ballpark, bro. Look at this. Is this their actual... This Is this their main base? I just... I don't know. Is it? Uh, does this tell you what eggs are in there? No eggs are in there. Okay. Um, is it... I don't think so. They have another base. I think this is just the other entrance. I have to be very careful. <laughs> Just, just, just a very, very careful around here. Nothing to see. Is it, any eggs? Looks like all the egg counts are zero in all of them. No? Okay. Oh, right, well, you know what? I've got a plan. I'm going to... Start doing this. And do that. Anything? Oh my god, there is. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is this is gonna be uh interesting to do i'm just gonna i think that's gonna be my method of survival teleporting in and then shooting a rocket as i leave god what is going on all right well time to teleport myself back to my remote location and see what's uh what's waiting for me please be friendly oh okay eggs Oh, nothing. Okay. They're just basic eggs. Um, all right, let's go a bit further in and try again. Oh, bro, this is so scary. What the? <laughs> what is this, man? I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Okay. All right. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Okay, we'll do it back here. And then I'm just going to go to last remote location. Well, actually, no. Screw it. I, I mean, I don't know if it went off or not because I went out of red render pretty quickly. We'll see soon. All right, let's go back. 
why not? Let's just go back and have a look, shall we? Hello? Okay. Didn't work. I shot too late. I need to try it again. Alright, back to home. Five. Three. Two. Let's shoot. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> that is like the most terrifying and like also the most broken thing ever. Dude, look at all like the Alpha Omega Origin blood we have. We literally, we have all of the best stuff like from most of the mods it looks like. I can't speak for uh, Omega, but in terms of uh, Primal Fear, yeah bro, no, this is, this is a lot. And my, uh, everything's gonna start getting packed up pretty quickly. But with all this hide and stuff, we can craft whatever we want and all the materials we got now. Let's have a look if I'm going to die. Okay, not dead. Any eggs? Uh, I don't think these are set to collect breeding eggs. I generally think these are just set to uh, collect dino eggs. Or for the ones they drop. I don't think any breeding is actually going on here. I'm assuming this is the same. It probably is. Alright, this time I'm gonna shoot the bubble, I think. Shoot the, yeah, shoot the bubble and then we'll do gen another time. Let's go back home. Five, four, three, two. Shoot. Oh, lucky me. I also just found their, uh, their electronics one last second. <laughs> I definitely needed that, I'm not going to lie. Right, I think this should be one of the last times we go back. We'll see if all the turrets and stuff are down. Is Jen down? No, it's Jen's down. I must mean everything's down down here. No, it doesn't. Huh. Interesting.